Oh! Can hand-drawn cartoons be scary? Yes, probably. <laughs> but we're just about to find out. This game is called Bendy and the Ink Machine, and you guys have been asking me to play this like crazy for so long. And finally, I've managed to download it and get ready to play. Now, I know nothing about this game. I know the art style looks very cool, and it's a chapter-based game. So this could become a really cool series. But without further ado, let's play chapter one and see what's going to happen. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Drew. Joey Drew, that sounds like a pretty intense name. Right, let's continue. I'm sorry, this guy is the guy that I've seen uh, in, in the screenshots and stuff. But apart from that, I know nothing. Chapter one, moving. Right, Joey, I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Yeah. Let's also stick those subtitles on so we know what you're saying. Boom. Right. Okay. So, um, new objective. Find the ink machine. Use W, A, S, and D in the mouse to move. See, look how cool this looks. It's super awesome, right? It's kind of like... It reminds me of like an evil Disney, I guess. It doesn't look too evil at the minute, but it's still kind of spooky. And I guess this is... Oh. Hello. Hello. I've seen you before. What are you doing there? Anything or are you just kind of chilling? Just chilling? Good. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, he's there as well. So I think this guy that invited me, Joey Drew, he um he wants me to see all of this stuff, but I'm not actually sure what happened to him. And then there's this guy everywhere. It's really spooky. Do I make a shadow? I don't! I'm a vampire. Or do I even exist at all, huh? Huh? This is eerie. See, look, it's everywhere. It's, it's kind of like the Mickey Mouse of this game, I, I guess. But, um, can we go through doors and stuff? Or do we just need to find the ink machine? I can't seem to run. Hey, Hello. Hey, old desk. I wasted so much time in this chair. Yeah. Okay, so this guy used to work for the animation company. That's cool. Did you leave to go and work on Finding Nemo? Is, is that what happened? Is that what happened, huh? Cool, so we're, we're already learning a little bit more about this story. Uh, that's where I came in. Let's go this way. Is there anything in the drawers? I can't, like, interact with anything. Not yet, anyway. So we're just gonna kind of... Oh! Dreams come true. And there's, like, drippy ink on the floor and the ceiling. That's a little bit strange. So is the ink machine upstairs? That might be what it means. There's old, like, animation things here, like projectors, records. This is cool. Oh, were you there a minute ago? I don't know if that guy was there a minute ago. <laughs> I already don't like this. So there's light coming out from these doors. I don't know whether that means there's people in it or whether... Oh, wait. Is this the ink machine? I think this is the ink machine. It is. Well, you worked here. I thought you worked here. You should know the ink machine. You need to use ink to make drawings. Um, okay, let, let's find that out. So our objective is literally turn on the machine. Um, so I must be able to interact with something, surely. Could there simply just be an on button? No? Is that way too simple? <laughs> turn on the machine. Buddy! I need your help. I need your help. The ink that was made to create you isn't on. The machine isn't on. So um, how do I do this? Huh? Huh? I don't think he's gonna tell me, but, um... Oh, wait, is this a button here? No. Okay, right, we need to find a way to turn this bad boy on. Let's go this way. There's a light this way? It's another animation desk? <laughs> You're creepy, buddy. Really creepy. The Illusion of Living by Joey Drew. So Joey Drew is the guy who invited us here, and I'm guessing he was, like, our boss at some point as well, which is pretty cool. Or is it cool? At this point, I don't get what Joey's plan is for this company. The animation sure aren't being finished on time anymore, and I certainly don't see why we need this machine. It's noisy, it's messy, and who needs that much ink anyway? Also, get this. Joey had each one of us donate something from our workstation. We put them on these little pedestals in the break room to help appease the gods, Joey says. Keep things going. I think he's lost his mind, but hey, he writes the checks. But I tell you what. If one more of these pipes burst, I'm out of here. Okay, so he used to make the employees put one of their personal possessions in, like, the break room so that they could please the gods. The gods of animation? I don't know. It doesn't sound like people really liked uh, 
the the ink machine that much probably because they could just use like pencils and stuff i guess um do we need these cogs i can't li i literally can't pick up anything let's see what's down here oh hello what are you doing here? Can I pick you up? I can't pick you up. You're just falling from the sky. How does something that big fall from something that small? <laughs> oh, oh, what's this? Whoa, you look like Ryuk from oh Death Note. God. Joey, what were you doing? Oh, oh, wait, what? That looks like Goofy with no chest. Oh, that's creepy. Was he making like real life Incomatronics? <laughs> He might have been. Um, Bendy in Sheep Songs. Oh, this is Bendy. Oh, man. What was he doing? Who's laughing now? Not me. That's pretty gross. Uh, see, see you later, Bendy. Um, sorry about your loss of chest. But um, you know what? I don't really know where to... Oh, wait. In here. I haven't been in here yet. So what's this say? All right. How do I get this to work? Okay. So fix the ink machine. Click objects to collect them. Okay, cool. What do we need, though? This is the main power. And it says low pressure. So we must need... Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so we need to find these items to put on the pedestals. This is what he was talking about earlier. Okay, I get it now. Finally. We need a cog, which I think we've already found. A screwdriver. A book. A teddy bear. A music note. And a piece of... Well, like a, an, ink, an ink well. Let's see what we can find. Um, right, I think I know where the cog is. Ah! <gasps> Who put this here? What? That scared the life out of me. Jeez. And who are you anyway? Because you're not bendy. I thought you were bendy, but you're not. <laughs> that scared me. Is this the cog that we need? Let's have a look. No, it's not. Because it, I think it was a bigger cog than that. Right. See you later again, bendy. Goodbye. And you. You. You stay where you are because I don't like you. Wait, a book. Is this the book? Hey, there we go. Can we pick up more than one thing? We can. Nice. Okay. So we've got a cog. We've got a book. I think we also need a spanner, an inkwell, and some other things. Um, oh, wait. There was a desk at one point. Let's see if we can find that desk where we used to work. Maybe there was an inkwell there. Okay. We haven't been in this room yet. So let's see if we can find anything we need any ink wells, any other things. Oh, ink pressure flow. Oh, so that's going to tell us if the ink is actually flowing, which obviously it's not because it's broke. Oh, I can jump as well. I didn't realize. Okay, good. But there's nothing, there's nothing here. Nothing that I need anyway. Maybe we need this room later? Yeah, there, there's definitely nothing in here. Okay, I'm heading towards the light. What have you got for me? Dreams come true. Okay, we've already done that. That's nice. Um... Oh, wait, look, the spanner. Nice. Okay, that's three out of six. We're actually making good progress. We just need an inkwell. Actually, we could either go back or we could just carry on and try and guess what we need. I know we need uh, an inkwell, but I can't remember what the others were. That's kind of annoying. Uh, I think my desk is nearby, though. Oh, wait, there it is. The inkwell, it's got a skull and crossbones on it. Of course it has. Also says no. Just no. So we have four things. We just need a couple more bits. And there's noises. I don't like them noises. The noises of God. It's even worse when that happens. Wait, here's my desk. Has my desk got anything here? It's got literally nothing. Awesome. So now I don't really know what I'm looking for. So I think I'm going to go back, see what we need. Wait, 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 wait. We might need this. We do. Music, of course. There's only one thing we need, and it's really annoying me that I can't remember what it is. Right, here's the room. So, oh, we don't need to put them in ourselves. Okay, so we've got cog, spanner, book, record, inkwell, and teddy bear. It's a teddy bear. Okay, right. I, I need to go and search for a teddy bear, guys. I will. I will try my best to find it as quickly as possible. Teddy bear. Teddy bear, can I just take you instead? No, you, you don't look that cuddly, to be fair. Teddy? Teddy, where are you? I just need to take you to a weird ritual space. It's okay. It'll be fine. Teddy. Teddy, it'll be okay. Don't be scared. Even though I'm getting increasingly scared. <laughs> oh, there it is. Hey, it's like a weird kind of... <laughs> it's a weird... Oh, well, I was going to say bendy, but that guy isn't okay, bendy. Okay, all of them. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. Oh, I know where that is. That's near the... That's in the projector room. That's, that's the flow button. Okay, let's go and find that right now. I've walked around this place so many times and I still don't know where the right way is. <laughs> oh. Remember, guys, dreams come true. Dreams come true. Here we go. Oh. 
I swear you weren't there before. Right, the flow room. Ah! <laughs> oh, man. Why, why are things happening? Why are you on the screen? What is your name? Tell me your name. Tell me right now. Oh, little devil darling. Uh, so Bendy, I'm pretty sure Bendy is the other guy. I now don't feel 100% confident, but here's the flow button. Bam! Oh, yeah. What do I do now? What do I do now? Tell me. Speak. Speak me. Uh-oh. Noises. Noises. It's where the pipe pressure is happening, I guess. Let's get back to the ink machine. I don't know what else to do. Yeah, let's go ink machine. There we go. Perfect. And now we can turn this on. What's my objective? Restore ink pressure. But I, I pressed the button. There's not another switch, right? Or is there? Restore ink pressure. So I've done the flow button. But that's it. Ah, yeah, here we go. So we need to pull this lever. Hey, caution. Nice. Oh. It's now got real dark. Mom, help. I'm scared. It's really, really dark now. Why would flicking the lever make it darker? Oh. Oh. Is it doing something to this? Hey, Bendy. Hey, Bendy. How's it going, man? You don't look too well, buddy. You don't look great at all. My objective is still to restore ink pressure. So let's try going back to the machine. Oh. Wait, what? Ah! Oh, my goodness. What is that? What is that? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Okay, I'm out of here. The floor is going to black. That scared me so bad. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. How do I get out? Where's the exit? It's somewhere around here. I can't even get out. Oh, jeez. I'm stuck. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Help. 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 Ah! Well, this isn't good. Uh, the creator lied to us. Oh. That scared me so bad. Oh, my goodness. What's wrong with these guys? I'm literally in a room and it's locked. Like, what do I do now? Are you going to scare me again? Don't do it. Don't do it. Hello? Hello? Um, oh, an axe. Perfect. Clear an old path. It certainly will. Smack. Smack. Nice. There we go. Why didn't we have that before when the guy was scaring us? So we just chopped him in the face. That would be amazing. <laughs> what are we doing now? Just like chopping firewood, maybe? I have no idea. Right? This is cool. I like this game a lot, but it- oh no. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Is- is this Tattletail? Are we back on Tattletail again? Oh wait. The screen's actually shaking. Okay. Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. So that's the end of the chapter. So as I mentioned at the beginning, this is chapter one. Chapter two is very, very close to be coming out. Um, I'm pretty sure anyway. I really enjoyed that. Thank you guys for suggesting that game to me. Very scary. Uh, it's like, it's a good atmosphere, and then it just kind of like, ugh, hits you with the jump scare. So, um, you know what? I really enjoyed that. So, if you did too and would like to see me play Chapter 2 when it comes out, then please leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. And if this happens to be the first video you see by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily gameplay videos. Apart from that, if you want to stick around and watch some more videos by me, why don't you check out this video right here? I think you might enjoy it. Look at this creepy face. It's very creepy. Go. Go quick before he takes you.